Hey everybody, this is Oregon at El Paso, and um, I got, today's my birthday, I turned 29, and I wanted to show you guys uh, a gift that I got today, so, uh, it's a gift from, let me put this down real quick, it's a gift from Jeffrey Phillips, of a, yeah, received, it's a, Story wheel, and I want to share with you guys what this fellow makes. In it, he leaves a cool note. Oh, sweet, he gave me some. Looks like he gave some little gifts. But I really. What? Check this out. This is one of, uh, this is Jeffrey Phillips from, he's based in Washington and he makes these guys called Star Wheels. Before we get to that, let me show you a previous one he had made. Let me get it off. This one is his first, uh, his first piece. Sorry, I'm shaking, but uh, a little nervous. So let me explain what I feel is going on, and from what I, I based off of my re, uh, understanding of what these things do is, so Jeffrey Phillips, he offers you, and you can find him on Facebook, he asks for your three favorite colors and your, and, and a conversation. So I gave him my three favorite colors and I gave him a call and we talked for a good bit, like talked like twice, he's a really cool guy, he's legit. And so, what I think is going on here with this little thing, see, in this, in this circle, the ring, it's made up of hemp. Okay? So then you have your copper. So if you study uh, Wilhelm Reich's um, research on orgone energy, his concepts of an orgone device include layering of organic and inorganic substances or, or different metals and, and cottons. So we have one layer of hemp with a layer of copper. And you have your hematites and magnetite on these right here, right? And you have and so what I think is going on is is that because you have natural earth magnetics with hematite, you have your man made magnetics, electromagnetics, but you also have your natural uh, earth magnetics. So the copper is highly conductive. So what I think is going on is it's capture, it's conducting the earth, the natural earth magnetics, and so it's going. All that energy is going round and 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 round. So you basically have a coil with a orgone concept and from my understanding also when you run energy through crystals it gets amplified more specifically quartz crystals so we have your quartz your smoky quartz and amethyst which are all um, quartz basically just amethyst has more iron and so and then you have your freshwater pearls so uh, it's basically like a little ball of energy or a, a pendant of, of this of orgone energy and then you have your stony meteorite your iron meteorite and snowflake obsidian so let's take a look at, at the new guy now I had this guy for a year more than a year and you know it's gotten a lot of attention and every it's pretty cool my overall view on it is you know when I first wore to sleep a couple of times I had dreams that I would in the dream I'd be wearing it and then when I look at it it would fall apart I remember the first time I freaked out in my dream because I was like how am I gonna tell Jeffrey that I broke it so every time I wear this to sleep it's in my dreams with me and every time I observe it it, it loosens like one time uh, this guy 
this amethyst right here in the dream he got he was just very loose I actually took this on tour with me I did I do stand up as well and um, I took it everywhere with me and during it the stony meteor fell out so I had to rewire it and add a little bit of super glue but you know this thing uh, Jeffrey told me it helped me see things a lot more clearly and man I cannot tell you how clearly I see things now and so this is a really good tool for the, for you know, for for who what I who I am and help me figure it out a little bit. So now let's take a look at this guy. See, so we have the same concept of a uh, of hemp and copper. There's all sorts of cool. I don't even know what any of these guys are. So we got green, orange, and yellow. And those were asked for these specific colors because in this star wheel, you now you have your. It's all. It's like red. In nature, it's like a so it's like very grounding base root chakra. You know, so I decided uh, so with integrating this for about a year and a half. Now I wanted to move up with the up to the eye, higher. So you have your orange, yellow, and, and green up to the heart. Next time I'm gonna ask him for uh, light blue, indigo, and violet, kind of like how I have on my. Um, tattoo here so for take too long uh, one second let me just want to share with you guys my piece you guys have a good day and um, take it easy Jeffrey Phillips on Facebook, find him up, take it easy guys.